And I think that we're, we're bridging that gap. Listen, I love it when I could wind up a guest and let them rip because there's gold backed up in that. You just gave us an entire two startup journeys. You walked through product market fit, AI. We're going to have to deal with this technology that doesn't really work because corporate profit margins like it and it's not really that great. It's not revolutionary. I'm somewhere in the middle, right? I think we're a long ways off of like AI coming up with like a full creative campaign yeah. positioning, or, you know, all of the stuff that like advertisers are great at, um, you know, where I, where I do see it is like, it's going to be like a force multiplier for like media buyers. And stuff. so you're basically going to have somebody that's more of a strategist, somebody who's more of a media director, instead of having to manage 50 people or hundred people, uh, they're going to manage like two senior people that will then manage AI. And then right. those other jobs, I don't think they're going to go away. I think they're just going to shift more to the creative side of the house and find other places to, to add value. I view it very much so as opening up human potential by getting rid of a lot of the monotonous stuff where we're not adding that much value. And so how we specifically use AI um, is number one, uh, we're using AI to actually hook into your CRM and use that as a source of truth. So closed one deal equals purchase. If you want to think yep. about how we transition from working with a DTC brand, lead equals website visit, that sort of thing. So one, we're using that to uh, do a lot of data enrichment and, um, you know, understand.